Hi dear viewers, this is Arash Kamali with another session of the website programming course on the Python programming language and the Django framework. A very warm welcome from me. If you remember in the previous session we worked with a date and we imported based on the time zone that we defined a specific date that we are dealing with. And if our day or month had one digit, we added a zero to it to make them comparable to one another. All right, now we change the format to a date format. Here we say year plus, that's right. And now again, we add a plus sign all right here, a string slash here a string a slash and because these are integer we need to change them to a string so that I will be able to let's say add them to a string so here I change the values to a string I change all of them preferably and then save them okay now I refresh and check the date. The date for 10 2019 has been made with a slash in between. Now I make a copy out of these codes and now I refresh and check. Okay, here as you see using the date, uh, the time delta function, I add to the date, I say date time all right time delta okay it equals with day equals 10. we have added 10 days now i refresh and check the date for 10 2019 today's date and 14 10 2019 is the date that i have just made or I can deduct 10 days from my date. I refresh to see the output for 10, 2019 is the date of today. And 24, 19, 2019 is the date of, that we made. I can add any number of days and months and years to my day to make a new one. All right. And make my favorite date. That's right. 